Welcome back to Good Design Stuff. My name is Bo and I love well-designed products and these are three that I like. This video is not sponsored. These are just products that I really enjoy and I think you will do too. All right, here we go. All right, the first nice design that I have for you today is the DJI Pocket 3. So it's a camera that I'm using right now so I can't really show it to you. So I found this device while searching for a small camera that could replace my phone to take videos and vlogs. I wanted something that is small, light, unsuspicious and shoots smooth footage in 4K. So basically what I wanted was an all-in-one camera where you don't have to be too tech savvy to understand all the settings, have to buy expensive rigs or audio devices. And that's when I found the DJI Pocket 3. Everything is built into the small camera. And so far, most of my videos on my channel have been recorded on this device. Uh, it's perfect for those who want to record in public but don't want to draw all the attention to themselves. The picture quality is nice and crisp and the built-in stabilizer makes the footage super smooth. You can record 4K videos in landscape mode or 3K videos in vertical mode. So it's perfect for Instagram Reels or YouTube Shorts as well. There are also recording options for slow motion and time-lapse videos. You can also track your face while you're recording, which works incredibly well. The interface is quite simple, but still needs some getting used to. A cool feature about the Pocket 3 is that you can rotate the camera and switch from selfie mode to rear-facing mode. Compared to other cameras where the quality of the front and rear camera are quite different, the Pocket 3 doesn't have that issue because it uses the same camera for the front and the rear facing view. You can also connect another screen and use it as a viewfinder in case the built-in screen of the Pocket 3 is not big enough for your needs. The built-in microphone is pretty good to capture your voice, but if you want even better audio quality, an external microphone, which I'm using right now, comes with the Creator Combo. A mic receiver is built into the main body of the camera, which you can connect with the microphone via Bluetooth. If you decide to go for the Creator Combo, it will also come with a windshield for your microphone. Inside the Creator Combo, there's also an extended battery handle, a tripod, and a carrying case. So this camera and especially the Creator Combo are not cheap. The camera by itself retails for 540 euros and the Creator Combo, which comes with all the items I just mentioned, retails for 680 euros on Amazon. So yeah, it's not the cheapest camera. But I will be traveling a lot this year, so this little device will come in really handy for vlogging and indoor recordings. So if you're looking for a compact vlogging slash camera setup, I think the DJI Pocket 3 might be interesting for you. If you need more input about the quality of the camera, you can check out my latest vlogs, which have been shot entirely on the DJI Pocket 3. So the next product that I have for you is the bullet pen. This bullet pen is a ballpoint pen uh, designed for unique environments. The bullet pen was developed to be used on the water or in zero gravity. Specifically, it was designed to be used by astronauts in space. That's why it's also called a space pen. The design of the pen is very minimalistic and sleek. So the colorway that I have here is matte black, but it also comes in silver or gold. So when the pen is closed, it's very compact and it has a nice weight to it. And when it's open, it's a full-size pen and has a nice balance to it. I don't carry a lot of pens with me anymore because um, I take all my notes on my laptop or on my iPad, but I always like to carry the bullet pen with me because the size and the weight are so insignificant. Product number three. Um, it's not specifically a product, but it's more a brand that I really like. So one of my favorite brands for premium leather products is Harbor London. They make high quality accessories like Apple watch bands, tech pouches, and laptop sleeves, but also desk mats and backpacks. So basically everything tech and gadget related. My favorite colorful leather is this beige tan color, but not every company makes a nice tan color. And personally, I think Harbor London makes one of the nicest, uh, softest leather that also feel very premium and it smells so nice. But besides the product itself, every time I order from Harbor London, the unboxing experience is very premium and satisfying. 
They are not the cheapest option, but they make products that will last. Okay, I have a bonus item for you today that I wanted to show you. I am... Uh... Okay, this product is interesting. So, I saw this everywhere on Instagram. It kept popping up in my feed. And this is called the A-Logic Matrix Ultimate 3-in-1. So this is a power station where you can charge your phone, your uh, Apple Watch and your AirPods. But that's not all. You can also use the main dock and remove it like so. And now this acts like a power bank. So you can just take it outside when you need it. And then when you get back, you can just pop it back in and it's charging the power bank, which is an amazing idea, I think. Also, the Apple Watch charger is removable, so you can just take it out like this. So you can place this anywhere that has USB-C, like your laptop or, an, or even an iPad and charge your watch right there. So everything seemed very nice until I received the product. Um, it was noticeably bigger than I expected. This is roughly double the size of the Anchor Cube that I presented last time but it's also slightly heavier by like 50 grams. The main issue that I have with this device is the way it looks like when you place it on a desk and open it. I feel like this looks way too big, almost like a transformer on your desk. If you're charging all your devices on this station, I feel like it looks a bit silly. It, there's too much going on. I feel like that foot extends way too far. I understand that they designed it this way because if you flip it back down, it's almost seamless and you know, it's it's almost like this uh, brick in a way. I understand it also acts for stability, that it acts like a counterweight so it doesn't tip over, but just the size of this thing is, is way too big. I think I, it feels a bit clunky. It feels, um, it doesn't feel sleek. It doesn't feel futuristic. Yeah, so I'm not the biggest fan of the design but let me know what you think. Would you get it yourself and use it? Uh, because I would not and I will probably return it because I thought, I thought the overall design would be a bit slimmer. Yeah, but I would love to hear your opinion. So one, one final product that I wanna show you is this product by the company MacTame. Um, they sent this to me as a gift and wanted to see what I think about it. And what's so special about these is that the cable itself is magnetic. You know when you use charging cables and then you want to put them away, you tie them around themselves or you use those Velcro cable ties. So with the MacTame cable, you just fold the cable in a certain shape that you like and it stays exactly like that. This is all magnetic and they kind of like fall back into shape, which is really cool. So they sent me a black cable and a silver cable. Um, the silver looks like this. And this is the black cable. So besides the magnetic aspect, these are also fast charging and, uh, tran and data transfer cables. So these are the 240 watts cables. The weight of these cables are slightly heavier than conventional cables, but, but they feel very durable and I feel like they will last for a long time. So these are the MacTame Mac cable. If you're interested, I will leave a link down below. All right, these were more than three products today, but I hope you liked it. If you have other well-designed products that I should take a look at, please leave a comment and I might feature that in the next episode. All right, that's about it. See you next time.